All right, here's how to change a spare. You're first you're gonna locate your spare, which it's gonna look like a little donut like that, really thin tire, smaller. On this Crown Vic, it's in the trunk up here in the hidden kind of up under it. But your wind, my tire's up there. Most cars I'm gonna guess are in the trunk, or if not, they're gonna be down under, but probably in the trunk on a car. There's gonna be a jack. I make no promises they all look like this one. But there'll be a jack, and then there'll be some kind of wrench to take your lug nuts off, and then also pop your hubcaps off. So this is an older car, so it got big fancy hubcaps, kinda, or you can call them fancy. But you just pop them off, and it'll just look like a regular rim here. Once you get all that stuff located, pull it out, jack it up, and then you can pop your hubcap off and start taking bolts off since I'm at home and just changing the spot tire because it's popped right there. You can see the wire. So I'm just using a gun, but this guy's a pry bar to break your bead probably and get your hubcaps off. Kind of just depends, but we're going to take these off and we're going to put that on and I'll show you that. All right, so we got that started. Whenever you put your uh, spare on this little lip right here, you can see right there, make sure that lip comes out. Just so make sure that's facing out, start all your lugs. Then you can use your wrench. They're gonna look like this probably, or it's gonna be a big X kind of, but you'll start that on there. Don't put your hubcap back on this tire. Don't put it on this one, but you can see at this tire, it's ruined, it's exploded. That's what old tires do, they just explode like that. So that's why we're putting new tires all the, way, all the way around on this. Even though the front two are new, but they're older tires. So we're gonna replace those two. But we're gonna tighten the stance. When you're tightening, make sure you do cross patterns. So, run the farthest side. That makes it a lot faster and now our tire is up on there and we're ready to go and find a tire shop to replace our tire all right so when you got her completely redone on there put everything back where it was so you know where it's at my tire did come with a cover so don't get if it's inside it probably gonna have that i'm gonna guess so don't overlook it and don't make sure you see that if you have a tire has a cover but that's gonna be it for this video like and subscribe. We'll see you in the next one. Peace.